while its origins remain uncertain, although certainly made in a northern European workshop, the Trivulzio Candelabra is datable to the second half of the 12th century. Executed in bronze, it is more than five meters high and imitates the form of the Jewish temple candelabra. It is studded with approximately 700 gems. The seven curved arms of the candelabra spring lightly upwards from the upper knobs on the stem and their length grows shorter from the lower to the upper levels, while the base is finely and delicately decorated with four dragons whose heads are immobilized on the ground by pairs of youths, apes, lions and griffins. Placed inside the volutes formed by the tails of the dragons on the front side are figures of dialectic and rhetoric, arts of the trivium, and music and geometry, arts of the quadrivium, to which correspond on the back four classical male nudes representing the four rivers of Eden. The spaces between the dragons contain at the lower level eight scenes from the Old Testament arranged in pairs, the original sin and Adam and Eve driven out of Eden, Noah's Ark and the sacrifice of Isaac, the calling of Moses and the crossing of the Red Sea, the coronation of Esther and David and Goliath. Higher above, the scenes of the virtues in combat with the vices are represented alongside the 12 signs of the zodiac. The biblical tale concludes with a representation of the great event on the central knob of the stem of the candelabra, the three magi riding towards the virgin and child enthroned. Appearing all around them amongst volutes of leaves is a double series of busts of the prophets, symbolizing the preparations for the coming of Christ.